Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and we are going to attach the drives to the computer. So we have our hard disk and we have our optical drive. Okay, we have our uh, case that we've already had the motherboard in and we have the top of our computer. Okay, so we actually have gone ahead and uh, just taped the top together like this. So I'm going to go ahead and place the top in position. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and tape it actually to the tab first of the computer here. So I'm going to just press that tab down. And uh, tape it on there. Okay, now what I'm going to do, we're actually going to attach the drives to the top of the computer. Um, okay, so first we're going to, and they're basically going to fit kind of like this. Okay, so we're going to put this up actually just, just like this. Okay, we're going to kind of line, um, we're going to kind of line this up. So this is going to end up being like this. So we're just showing through the front. So we just lay it down like this. Okay. We actually put this down over the top of it. You notice I've already, um, I've already uh, folded it here. Okay. So we get that right where it's supposed to be. It's already folded up. Okay, and now we're going to go ahead and um, pull this back here, okay, put the other side down, okay. All right, now it should, when we swing it into place, just sit there pretty nicely like that, okay. All right, so we're going to leave it just like that. Okay, we're also going to go ahead and attach the hard disk drive. Okay, notice that our connectors are out the back here, okay. Now you can attach the hard disk drive either way that you want. Okay, but then we're going to go ahead and use this, um, so we're going to go ahead and fold up. You actually fold the bracket like this, so you actually have the bracket pointing out. Okay, so we're just going to put that over the hard disk drive like this. Okay, you want to kind of move the hard disk drive out to the end of the, the uh, um, optical drive there. Okay, so this is actually how a computer would be put together. Now every, you know, every case is different, every set, every um, method of attaching these is different on every different kind of computer, but this gives you a really good idea of how it would, it would fit together in real life. So we just go ahead and just pull it up here, okay, and we can actually set it down now, um, just like this. Okay, so let's go ahead, the, um, the tabs of the, um, the tabs of the top of the case are actually going to help us to, um, can take out the CD drive just for a moment here while we finish uh, putting everything together. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and uh, just tape down the, the other tabs that are going to attach it to the front of the case. Okay, and all this is going to help with the, um, with the uh, problem of the whole thing collapsing here. <laughs> okay, so I'm actually going to tape this on the inside. just what you want sometimes. Okay, we put that right up just like that. Notice how we're just kind of zipping this whole thing up here. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and put the CD drive back in, or the optical drive back in. Just like that, just slide it right down in there. Okay, now we go ahead and stand it up. It shouldn't collapse quite as badly on us and notice that this, the optical drive shows through the front of the computer just like that, okay, just like it would an actual computer. Okay, now we can go ahead and um, open this up like this. Now in a real computer, this is exactly what would happen. You know, you can slide the drives out the back just like this of the brackets. Okay, so we have our brackets in place. We have our drives in place. Now we're going to go ahead and attach the SATA cables. Okay. And you'll see on the back here, it's not exactly correct, okay, the sizes on this are a little bit off, okay, but the, basically the SATA, you'll notice the ports, you'll see that it has a small SATA and a large SATA. The small one is for data, and that's going to plug into the, um, to the motherboard, and the large one is for the power, which is actually going to be a different cable coming in off of the, um, off of the power supply. So let's just go ahead and attach those first outside the, 
the case, and then we'll go ahead and just slide the drives in, and we'll be ready to make those attachments onto our motherboard. Okay, so let's go ahead and slide in the hard drive back into the slot first. Okay, a little bit complicated here, but once it's back in, it's back in. Okay, so now we have our hard drive and our optical drive all into our case, and SATA cable is attached. Good luck.